add a user, simply click on Administration, Settings, and under General, select Users. You will see the owner of the book already listed as the administrator. Now click on Add, and you will have the choice of adding an existing Reckoning user or creating a new user. We'll select Existing Reckoning user. Enter their Reckon ID. Click on Check Username to verify the existing user ID. Next, you must assign a role. There are four basic roles to choose from. Administrator, with full permissions to the book. Limited, with only view permissions. Super user, which has the same permissions as the administrator, but without the ability to edit other user details. And support, which can be enabled to allow application support to be performed. If these choices do not fit your requirements for this user, then you can create a new role first. We'll select a super user. You can click on show details to see the list of permissions granted. Where a full green circle means full permissions, while the yellow partial circle means limited permissions. Click on save and close. You can add any person as a user. Select new user. Fill out the basic personal details and select a role. In this case, a limited user. Click on show details to see the limited permissions. Click on save and close. The new user will get an email with a user ID and password. Your user is ready to go. Thank you for watching this video and if you have any questions please go to reckon.com forward slash support.